Okay, so I'm gonna admit I've been stressing myself out a little bit trying to think of videos given that it's late September, you know? So I'm just gonna react to NBA Media Day. Did anybody think you would ever see this tweet about Alex Caruso wanting to change his number because of Bill Russell, but he can't because he's top 75 in jersey sales? I thought this was a fake tweet when I first saw it. We've also got Jimmy Butler's hair, which has been a, quite a topic of conversation. Hey, look, man, I don't have the guts to attempt anything remotely close to that hair, so I'll give him the respect just for that. I'm just messing with stuff to make the internet mad. We got an actual basketball thing from Miami, though. Uh, Bam's goal is to try to get to 18 shots per game. Shout out to ZH Highlights. This is the one game I keep on remembering from Bam, where he just went at Al Horford or whoever happened to have been switched on to him or whatever, as many possessions in a row as he could. Like, this is the BAM that Miami needs just more often. Do they need it every single game? I mean, you don't need 31, but just the aggressiveness in looking to score as opposed to being a facilitator first, pretty much. And now we've got some Pat Bev and Westbrook stuff. Pat Bev told ESPN that Westbrook has been his best friend on the team since being traded to the Lakers. This is when Russ is playing with, with the, the Houston Rock. He comes to me during the game like, yeah, man, I, I got your sister, of course, I tickets. But if I was to name a best friend, it would easily be him. Easy. Easy. We work out together. We lift weights together. We chat all the time. Well, there you go. That's a nice, wholesome story. Speaking of the Lakers, we got LeBron, AD, and Russ. And if you want to psychoanalyze it all day, just look at this little moment where Russ is, like, a little farther away from them. He takes a step in. Did Skip Bayless run with that one yet? I don't know, but he does have this picture with him and Lil Wayne. You gotta say, man, the Skip-Lil Wayne friendship is just good stuff. I'm happy for both of them. Skip, that shirt is too small. Wait a minute. Is his shirt too small? Uh, maybe my eyes don't work. I mean, it's probably like, yeah, you, you, okay, fine. Uh, Nerland's Noel says he wants to be back in the Defensive Player of the Year race. This was a thought that I had the other day where I was like, are we just done with the potential of Nerland's being one of the best defensive players in the league? I mean, he's still good, no doubt. See this mini mic from my hands. What's up, Clipper Nation? We're here day one. You know, media day. Let's get this over with and fly to Vegas. Kawhi is such an enigma, I swear. We also got ourselves a Kawhi laugh. This is huge. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like this is the I'm being polite, but I didn't actually find that that funny laugh. Okay, so an NBA player chose to do a box out for something they would do during a game. This player plays in the Cavs. Who do you think this was? Was Robin Lopez. Zion says he's at his best right now. Let's look at a Zion dunk to end this. Okay, I lied. It's going to be a layup. Look at this assist from Eric Bledsoe. Remember him on the Pelicans? Zion's so good, bro. 